What's up, YouTube? This is Jordy Lux, and I am bringing you another episode of Vogue Setups. Alright, so we're just gonna start off right here in the middle. We got the bed, got the fuzzy blanket, which is probably from Home Goods, all right? Because that's one of my favorite stores ever. Um, we got some decorative pillows. That one is of uh, Sure Shot and I, the boyfriend of seven years. Got it two years ago for Christmas. We got the UCLA pillow pet. I used to collect these. I probably have at least 20, if not more but I don't know where they went because when I moved, <laughs> I lost like everything I own. So yeah, there's that. Um, but we got him, Joe Bruin. We got this little, I don't even know what it is, but it's a little fox, named him Hootie. I mean, he's just the cutest. Literally sits right on top of my bed and it's when I'm streaming, you can just see him in the back sometimes. It's kind of funny. All right, new addition to the bed. We have mocha latte frappuccino. Currently going ham on a treat. She just decided to pop up on here, so I definitely had to include her in this video. Look at her. She's so cute. Huh? Oh, okay. <laughs> Enjoy your treat. All right, so going over here. This I just like to call like my little zen corner. So we have I Am Peace, a book of mindfulness. I got that for my 21st birthday. It just kind of always reminds you to be mindful of your surroundings and whatnot. I have Altoids, always gotta stay minty fresh, Apple TV remote, regular TV remote. This is a pumpkin apple candle, an actual pumpkin, which needs to be thrown away because I've had it since October, but I mean, it doesn't look like it's going bad. So yeah, it's just been there. And then a paw print ornament kit. So this is pretty cool. I'm gonna be able to put Mocha's paw print on a piece of clay. And then after it dries, I can add a ribbon and tie it to a Christmas tree. And then last but not least, I mean, aside from like the tissues back there, I have my uh, diffuser. This is one of two in my room and it just pretty much diffuses essential oils and always keeps my room smelling good. So to the right of my nightstand, I do have this Polaroid camera. It is super useful. I take it on pretty much any trip that I go on and I most definitely will be taking it too. DreamHack, February 2020. We got a lot of people from Team Vogue going. It's gonna be a really good time. So make sure to say hi if you are there. Um, we also have some Polaroids that I've taken on various vacations and stuff like that. Um, right next to it. So this is kind of just where I hang my stethoscope. I have that one. This is a newer one that I got when I graduated from nursing school in August of this year. When I did graduate too, I also got this really awesome pin. You only get it for graduating with your bachelor's of science degree in nursing. So it's been a pretty big year for me. Um, I was in nursing school for three years and it's really crazy to be done, but I'm just super excited. I have a brand new stethoscope ready to be used. So any hospitals out there looking for nurses, let me know. All right, so moving on over here. This is my one Christmas decoration, tis the season. Back there, we got a J. Dude, look at these old Xbox games. We have Fallout 4, Mortal Kombat X, Call of Duty, what is this? Advanced Warfare, Destiny, Diablo, 2K. We got some movies. Literally, I don't touch anything over here. This is a wine bottle from Malibu Wine Safari. Giraffes are my favorite animal, so I definitely wanted to keep that. Um, right here, this is actually the corsage that I wore to prom. They were purple flowers at one point. I mean, it's been, that was literally in the year of 2013, but definitely not getting rid of it. Um, I also have, these are coasters that I saved from Europe when I went to different pubs and whatnot. And then this is just a bunch of random stuff. I got boxes, candles, calligraphy brushes. We have a duster. Always keep your setup clean. Dust, dust, dust. This is a headset, um, the Astro A10s. I don't use those anymore, but still a great headset. Would definitely recommend, especially for the price. And one of my favorite parts right here 
is this custom Xbox controller. It says Jordi Locks on it. It is pink and black, and I just absolutely love it. And then also, I keep this right below my printer. Best part in my room, my my bachelor's degree. We got the actual diploma, it's official. Moving over to the left, I have a Hydro Flask. It keeps me hydrated during every stream, and it's also the reason why people call me a Visco girl. I have a fidget spinner. I literally, I had so many of these when these were popular. They were all the rage, but this was my favorite one. It's the only one I still have. For my, well, for my mouse pad, it is NZXT. It is, I want to say, the large one. It pretty much covers my entire desk. I have the HyperX Cloud Mix in white and rose gold. This is my headset. It's super nice. This is something my mom gave me for Christmas. Jordan's beer goes here. Fantastic. This is a little charging station for my phone. I use a uh, blue snowball microphone. Um, it is the Black Ice Edition. I just keep this right here. This is something that like me and my family always say to each other. We always have said this for a very long time. I love you to the moon and back. So it just stays right there. My second diffuser back there. We got a stream deck where I can literally tweet when I go live, make clips, stream markers, do chat commands, open up websites, games, change scenes, all that jazz. This is a Logitech keyboard. I'll put the exact one down below, but I mean, it's pretty good to start out. Same with the Razer Death Hatter Elite mouse. I've only been on keyboard and mouse for about three months. So this has honestly been a really great one for learning and it's not a bad price at all. And then for my monitors, I have two. This one is ergonomic. I like it because it conserves space on my desk and I pretty much just read chat on here. So I didn't need anything crazy. It's literally just 60 Hertz. Webcam is right there. It is the 1080p C22, C922 Logitech camera. And right here, this is the better monitor of the two. It is a Scepter and this one is 144 hertz. So this is where I get to see my games and I'll watch videos and different things like that. All right, this is my baby. I had never had a PC before, and I decided to go big or go home and buy the NZXT streaming PC. I will link it down below. It is a beast of a PC, and I am so happy that I went with it. I can game from it. I can stream from it. I have zero complaints. It has been absolutely incredible. I have this little watch, a uh, little tiny converse that my friend gave me, so it just stays right there. This is a Oxford University shot glass. I actually meant to give this to my uncle. I brought it back for him. Haven't given it to him yet. So if you're seeing this, I promise I'll give it to you soon. And my Google Home. This is literally brand new. Hey Google, set key color light to blue. Super cool. Going back, only a couple more things. I have my Xbox right there. Honestly, it's getting a little dusty. I haven't used it in a while. But, I mean, if I want any Xbox games and I feel like going back to that controller life, I will turn it on and use it. And then last but not least, we do have my alumni flag from West Coast University. And down here, this is something I made live on stream. It says Holidays with the Lock Squad. That's actually my writing that I cut out using a Cricut machine. And Pretty much what I do is I will put different names of people that subscribe and we have literally cut out every single leaf individually and uh, painted the trunk of the tree and just we're, we're building it together and we're gonna have this going until January of 2020. That pretty much wraps it up. I have so many memories in this room and uh, I just wanted to take you guys a little walk down memory lane, capture some of those. There was one thing I forgot to describe and you may have noticed that I had this person Queen Elsa right here next to my monitors. She always stays there. A lot of people don't know that I used to be a Disney princess and I did Elsa the most. So it's just a reminder of what I used to do. It was something that I loved doing. So yeah, it stays right there. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, check out my streams at 
www.trishtv slash jordylocks. You can also follow my socials at jordylocks on Twitter and Instagram and at jordylocks underscore on TikTok. Also make sure to do the same for all things Team Vove. Best team ever. Vove the F up. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day. Oh,